Hello, I'm Agus Swanto, and now I want to share my experience to learn English and to to share my experience. First, I want to show you something. What is this? I think all of you have known this. This is radio, right? But but maybe why I bring this device to you? Maybe you want to know what can we do with this radio. But before. I start telling you something, but let me first give my give my um, appreciate, give my honor to my English teacher, uh, Mr. Muklasusa, for his inspiration uh, for me to learn in another way of learning in the classroom. This is uh, my radio. I bought it in the year 1998 when I was still at the first grade of my senior, senior high school. And this is not really expensive at the time, because in fact that I can get many things from the radio. I think my radio is quite different from another radio, because it has more uh, short wave, uh, as the other normal radio has only two short wave and it has a nine short wave what can we do next with the radio I think that I was very amazed with the radio after my teacher Pausa tell me that we can learn English from the radio program then I try to start my learning activity by using the radio at the time uh, I can listen many English programs in the, af in the afternoon, in the evenings, if you want to attend, uh, tune in the learning uh, program in English. And the radio station I like most is the BBC because the BBC offers us so many English programs for the beginners up to the end points. And every evening, I sit on my chair and then I turn on my radio and I start to listen. I prepare uh, my PowerPoint and a piece of uh, paper to write um, the, the, the lesson I hear from the, the radio. And I still remember well the program at the time that I uh, always tune in at the afternoon, such as the long way round. Um, this is uh, the English program for beginner, uh, which tell us about the journey of two people, Moorcroft and and his uh, sister. They go around the world, and then uh, finally, in the end of the program, uh, they decide to find uh, their way back. And there is also another program that is Way In. Way In is the program from the BBC with this. Uh, cry uh, about um, the living in the hotel, the way in. And also, there is a Campus Speech. Campus Speech is uh, um, the program which uh, tell us about um, the word we use uh, in computer. Um, there is also another program from the BBC for Edmund, uh, it's like uh, the world today, uh, every women, um, and then uh, book self, all the book self, this program for the Edmund's level. And I know that it was very difficult for the first time to learn from the radio and I uh, told uh, but Yusa, but this is very difficult and then uh, continue, continue listening and I continue my activity to listen and and sometime I went to Pak Yusa house and we learned uh, together, we listened to this program together in the afternoon um, in the big table with his family and this is something great in the way I learned to develop my English and until now, I still use the radio, although uh, we, we now have so many uh, modern devices to, to get information from the internet, such as the podcast and, and many other programs online. And because I think that the radio 
has something that the device uh, doesn't uh, have, such like its simplicity. It's very simple to turn on the radio. I only need to buy a battery, uh, two batteries, and then I turn, and then I can choose uh, what program I really like. And you, you know that from this radio, not only BBC that we can learn, but any other radio station such as uh, Voice of America from 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 America, VOA. It has also the English program at night, uh, all about English. The program is all about English uh, at 10 o'clock, and then after finish, we had a dynamic, a dynamic English, also from um, Voice of America. Well, and uh, another radio program we can hear is just just like a China radio, the national uh, ABC from Australia, Australia. Uh, uh, casting Corporation, uh, Islam Voice from Malaysia, uh, Christian Voice from Australia, uh, or, or Radio Singapore International. All oh, we can hear from this radio. So the only thing we need to to do from the from the radio is listening, 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 and listening more. And what's benefit to be get from the radio is that we can hear the pronunciation from the native speakers directly so we can try to um to adopt to follow to imitate the way the western people pronounce the word and i think um, this uh, radio uh, gives us so much benefit and advantage it it gives me so much advantage things uh, and I think that my listening skill uh, getting improved from my my activities listening to the radio almost uh, every day I spend my uh, three hours to listen to uh, the BBC program and I know one of my favorite uh, radio anchor from the BBC is Alan Johnson because we had uh, we had a bad news when uh, some extremists kidnapped kidnapped him, and then uh, finally he can he could release uh, from the kidnap. And also, I have one BBC anchor from Asia, and I think he is my inspiration, uh, Muhammad Makbul. Muhammad Makbul is the only Asian people who can work uh, in, at BBC and his English is very good. He speaks just like the European or American speak English. So, from this radio, if you have your radio, I think you can start to learn English by optimize the menu from, from this simple device. Do you want to start learning activity outside of classroom, outside of ordinary way of learning English, only from reading a book, reading structure, reading a grammar book? I think it's boring. So from radio, you get something that you cannot find from the classroom. I think that's all from my sharing about how is the way I learned English but once again I give uh, my great honor to my English teacher Pak uh, and may Allah give you barokah may Allah give you something good for you your family your big family and Allah always give you good health um, I think it's all for now Thank you very much and goodbye.